all right guys so it's your boy pure edits back with another video and today i'm going to be showing you how to do masking uh the apps you're going to need is let me see where the fuck is it at okay you're going to want video star you're going to want this super impose you just drag those out right quick i should have had this ready Sorry, a nigga slacking. All right, so you're gonna have that, that, and um, that's basically it, to be honest. So after you do that, let me just put this shit in the same. All right, so I'm gonna be using this clip right here. Uh, the just the beginning. I'm not gonna be doing the mask on the whole fucking thing because that's just gonna take a fucking year. Anyways, here it is. All right, so that sexy sync is over, and let me go to video stars. What you want to do first? I'm not trying to put my face in the damn video, so let's see. Edit video. Uh, where's that? All right, right here. Fuck. Hold on. So you're gonna want to choose your video, make video, obviously. Y'all guys shouldn't be fucking on this tutorial if you don't know how to do that shit. Anyways, okay. So look, see how I move this circle thing at the bottom right here? Well, you're going to want to take a picture every time the guy moves until you don't want. I don't know. This is basically how you fucking mask, okay? So let me just show you. So picture right here at the right side of the screen. Boom. Press done. You could even tap on the picture. Boom. Done. Damn. I didn't notice this nigga moves every fucking Wait, shit. Anyways, I don't even know if I'm gonna be doing every single one of these, but you just gotta take a picture of each frame. I'm nothing. Okay, you know what? Uh, fuck it. I'm only gonna do like three just to show y'all, and then y'all could just basically understand what the hell I'm talking about. You're actually going to want to have a, a slow video in the background anyway, so what you're going to want to do is make this black, black key, and then you're going to want to press it again, and then import background, no, 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 import foreground, so you're going to go to your photos, and then just choose the first one, which will be this one. So, it, the size doesn't really matter to be honest. The background so what you want to do is press mask and then okay let me just show you these tools so this tool right here gets rid of the background see how I just press it and then some of it just turn black you press it on this right here you're trying you're just trying to get just the person in the middle is what I'm trying to get okay fuck redo let me just try to do that right quick. All right, so basically what's left is the guy and so a few things in the background. So what you wanna do is get the eraser. And then at the bottom right, press the negative right here. So it takes away the black. Like that. And let's say if I fuck up and go like that on accident, you could easily go press the bottom right, press the plus sign, and then go like that to take it off. But I'm not doing that, so I'm gonna undo everything and then I'm gonna just keep erasing everything. Okay, I think I got that. Got that, all right. So now I'm gonna just zoom in on his hair because I think that turned black. Damn, close the door of the way! Fuck. Alright, my bad guys, my bad. My, my mom always does that shit. 
All right, so at the shoulder, I can see some black. Whoa, wrong one. Get his ears. Okay, never mind. Okay, this is basically his hair. Oh, shit, I just got it all. All right, so after you got all his hair done like that, Boom, boom. You guys are copying. All right, so after you're at this point, two things. All right. <coughs> Basically, after you're done with that, right? You go to home, the bottom left. Press this export button, mask as PNG. All right, so next one, you're gonna press import foreground again, and then you could just put replace it, which means um, you're gonna have to redo everything or replace but keep this mask, which means it's gonna just stay the same as this dude, but I just like to uh, replace it because sometimes I forget shit. See how it moves? Anyways, you go to mass and just do the same exact things. So I'm probably just gonna speed up this process right now. Alright, so now I'm back. I kinda did like five of the uh, masking things. I didn't feel like doing any more, but um yeah, so Go back to NVIDIA start, right? So what you want to do is go to multi-layer, pick this one, and then for the front, you want to choose photo. And you're going to want to do the first PNG you did, which is this one right here. And I know the masking is not that great, but look at the head on each and single one of these. Um, I noticed that because if his hair is black, and yeah, if his hair was white, it would you know what I'm saying? I would have had this shit done right away. But I had a little difficulties. You know what I'm saying? So which one to click is none. Then you want to click is next. Kind of takes forever for some reason. But uh, all right. Let's go all the way to the right. Oh, it's taking forever. So it says solid color. You want to choose this light green. Go to the one. Then what you want to do is tap on the screen until it changes. So then right there I put zero. Right here is a hundred. So keep that at hundred. Then create. You're just gonna want to keep repeating that process with each different um, photo. So here's a second photo. If you need another demonstration. Go all the way to the right. Light green. Go to the one. Go back. Press zero. And then you're gonna, it changes to this frame, which is it matches the frame. So basically, you're just trying to match the frame. And if I go, it changes frames again. So I had to put zero. So I guess create. And then redo the same thing. So right now, I'm just gonna fast forward it till I'm done with all the green. Oh, all right. All All right, so I'm back with the green, and as you can see, it kind of moves. I kind of fucked up the masking, but I didn't know because it wasn't really a good mask to start with because of his hair. And the jersey, I didn't know it had the black was in it like that. But um, uh, yeah, so what I could do is just go to multi-layer to fix that real quick. 
Okay, so basically now that I'm done with this, five, I only did five frames, but that's all it gives me is this. So what now you want to do is um, go to multi-layer, click the clip, click, um, what are you going to want to click? I think you're going to want to click this one. No, no, no. I said that wrong. So you're going to want to click the first clip you put in and then the last one that you just finished with the green. Then you're going to go to color. Towards. It doesn't have the green in it, but I don't know why um, it does that, but I think. Okay, fuck it. We're just going to have a little bit of green. So once you do that, you're going to go all the way to solid color again and you're gonna pick the light green again so it's like that and then you pick or click next so what you have is this right here so then you're gonna want to go to multi-layer then click the first one and then click the last one again i think all right so now that you click or the green selected or whatever from color then you go to next and what I like to use this effect right here, I had to buy it, but um, I guess it was worth it. Oh, it doesn't move. Well, it doesn't really matter because you fucking can't even see a lot of it. I didn't do enough frames to where you can. But I like this one because it kind of hides it wherever you mess up. It kind of hides it and it's kind of trippy and it's colorful. I like the colors on my edits uh, but you could either use any of these uh, you could put it to black if you wanted to it doesn't look as good because the background's already black but um yeah you get the point you could just mess around maybe do that i don't know um another thing that you could do is put this fuzzy right here you can tell what i'm doing here let me just to this what i did on my other edits was i go like this i move it to the right no you are so dumb you are really dumb for real yeah. all right then i just move it like that See how it does that. Anyways, you could just mess around with it, do some shit like that. Be creative. Try to be original. I guess after this video, I'm not going to be original anymore. But yeah, guys, that's how you do the mask. Um, I don't know if you guys want another tutorial on something else. Just let me know in the comment section and I'll be down to do anything. But uh, yeah, peace. And there's my face.